This is the 2024 Volkswagen GTI that includes 241 horsepower and can go from 0 to 60 in only 6 seconds. Today, Andrew Durham takes a spin in the GTI with Justin from the Auto House of Peoria. This is Riding with the Rivermen. All right, now we're back. We have a couple technical difficulties, but that's normal. Um, riding in the 2024 Volkswagen Golf R that is still currently available, even celebrity driven. Celebrity driven? <laughs> who, do we, who do we got behind the wheel on that? <laughs> well, this is Justin, but I'm not a celebrity. It's the river. But, um, so, I guess the big thing is how long have you been with the river? Uh, so I've been with the Riverman pretty much all season. Um, I started with the ECHL at the beginning of the season, but uh, got here at about Halloween. And then uh, last year I played here from uh, Christmas to February. Uh, so I, uh, I was here for uh, for a couple couple weeks last year. Um, happy awesome. to be back and happy to be uh, a part of it for most of the season. Glad to see season. the Peoria fans, right? Yeah, absolutely. Because those absolutely. guys, I will tell you, they are diehard. Oh, I, I, agree. <laughs> I agree. I've seen how much they go for the auction, like the jerseys. Unbelievable. Um, so they take care of it for sure. Uh, what is the favorite food? Favorite food? I'm a, I'm a big Mexican food guy. Uh, okay. Um, Along with is, myself. Which is tough. I haven't necessarily found a great uh, great option in the in the area for the Mexican food, so I'm still in the, I'm still in search mode for that. But uh, Lorena's, have you been there yet? I have not been there yet. That's East Peoria, right across the river. Shout out Lorena's. Very okay. Good. Okay. I'll have to try it. Yeah. I'm from Texas, so. Oh, then uh, that's that's. There's not going to be a comparison. <laughs> I do apologize yeah. for that. <laughs> so I've been I've been spoiled my whole life on the Mexican food. Well, that was the next question. Where are you from? Yeah, so I grew up uh, in a town just northeast of Dallas called Plano, okay. uh, Plano, Texas. I graduated from high school there, all that stuff. Um, lived there my whole life. So. Awesome, awesome. I miss it every day. Let's say it's probably a little warmer now. Just going to throw that out. Yeah, it's pretty warm here today, though. I'm, it is I'm nice. Really it's, pleasantly is, surprised. This yeah. is rare for February. Really pleasantly <laughs> surprised. Um, what is the go-to sport or favorite sport besides hockey? Uh, besides hockey, I mean, I'm from Texas, so I gotta say football. Um, okay, we haven't heard football yet. So yeah, I got I gotta say football. I mean, my uh, when I was in high school, um, Kyler Murray was. Uh, the quarterback for Allen High School, so I watched him. Oh, that's smoke, pretty cool. I watched him smoke my high school for two years. Um, I, I think he was a, I think he was a true freshman the first year I saw him play us, and awesome, awesome. Uh, he actually never lost a high school football game in his whole career. So, wow. um, did not know that. Which didn't bode well for for my school. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, it, it was. It's you know, it's another. Uh, it's like a religion down there. So I'm a big football guy. Favorite movie. Favorite movie? Oof, that's tough. Um, that's what everybody said. That, that, that's really that's really hard to get put on the spot for that. But, um, there is a movie that not many people know um, oh. called The Grand Budapest Hotel. I've never and, heard of it. Uh, of course, I'm not going to be able to remember the guy who plays the main character, but. Same guy who plays Voldemort in Harry Potter okay. is the main character in, uh, in the Grand Budapest Hotel, and of course his name is escaping me now that I'm being put on the spot. <laughs> but, on the spot. But it's a great, it's a great film. Awesome, awesome. What? Where do you see yourself in five years? In five years, in five years, I will be retired from hockey. I can, I can say that confidently. Okay. Um, this is what we want to know. <laughs> confidently, I'm, I'm getting up there in age. Uh, and hopefully in five years, I, uh, I'm a full-fledged uh, fireman back home. I've, uh, I've got some buddies that have, that have joined the fire departments around Dallas uh, and all the suburbs and whatnot. And uh, I think it's something that, I would, uh, that I'd really enjoy. And, uh, so hopefully in five years, I'll be, uh, I'll be in the thick of my career as a, as a firefighter. It's the way to do it. Um, the one question I've asked everybody, what is your least favorite team to play against? least favorite team to play against man um the list is a mile long <laughs> yeah yeah honestly 
I'd have to say, I'd have to say quad, um, quad cities. Um, they're not hard to play against. Like we do well against them fairly, like consi six and one, fairly, no consi deal. yeah, <laughs> fairly consistently. Um, but the thing that happens is, you know, when we get up by two, three, four goals on them, then it just starts to become kind of a, a melee type deal going on. And All right, guys, driving in the wonderful 2024 Golf R, doing Ride with the Rivermen. We appreciate you watching. Have a great rest of your day.